You've probably heard that finding your truth is the ticket to true happiness, but self-examination and realization, that's not easy. In fact, it's something our guest Natalie struggled with, so we set her up with Shaman Durek for some spiritual guidance. Hi. Hi, Hi how are you? So I've been struggling with depression and anxiety for five years, and it started after my mother passed away. I was raised to be my mother's daughter and not my own individual. And then when she passed, I didn't know who I was as Natalie. What do you think has been getting in the way of you getting to where you need to be? I think fighting with myself as to what I think I know I should do with my life and still trying to be the person that my mom intended me to be and I feel like I'm not gonna be good enough. And that's how it was with my mom. I was such a good child, but I was never good enough. You're angry with your mom, right? I am. Mom had a lot of rules. Are you putting rules on yourself right now in your life? I am. So you're creating a box and trying to fit in it and then getting anxiety of wondering why you're not fitting in a box. Depression and anxiety is because you keep lying to yourself because you have that part of you that became your mom. <laughs> That's so true. All the restrictions she gave me, I, I, I give myself. And that's, that's crippling, because I'll never be myself if I, until I let that go and allow myself to, to just live. Anytime depression and anxiety shows up, the way we look at it in shamanism, is it means that you are living against your grain. We're living a truth that we think we have to live in order to be loved, liked, and seen. So I want you to put your hand in the center of your palm. Good. And I want you to tap it and say, Mom, are you there? Mom, are you there? I'm always here. Now that you're on the other side. Mom, now that you're on the other side. What do you feel about my life now? What do you feel about my life now? She's proud of me. Do I need to be hard on myself and create anxiety, Mom? Do I need to be hard on myself and create anxiety, Mom? No. So now you just got confirmation from the other side. Can I clean out some of this sadness and energy out of your body? Yeah, that would be great. Yeah, is that okay? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and start doing that. 6,000, 7,000. Spirits begin to vibrate her body and clean it out of where she's been storing it. 10,000, 15,000. <sighs> Keep cleaning out of her until she laughs uncontrollably, spirits, and clears herself from all anxiety and depression. 20,000. Return her power to her and charge her system now. <laughs> See, that's yours. That belongs to you. That's what's been missing. Spirits, shock her body with uncontrollable laughter at 5,000. Have her laugh at every time she tried to put herself in a box that she couldn't fit at 9,000. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Wow, who are you? I actually feel myself. I feel so light. Wow. It's a wonderful thing, isn't it? You're such a blessing. So are you. What you see in me is what you see in yourself. I was so afraid to just be me.